Hello, Gosslings, and welcome back to the Cursed Slash Haunted Obelix series. Today we're covering October 2023. Now, this month, I promise I will discuss my Halloween decorations and the curses behind them, and that's what we'll do. First on my list is a boo -bert. Now, boo is an unassuming, perhaps even cute, stuffed ghost. Well, that's where you'd be wrong, Gosslings, because he's all those things and a little evil. Now, this guy will silently and quietly go boop, which you might not think is that annoying, but at 10 a.m. every five minutes all you hear is boop, boop, would drive you insane, and that's what was happening to the owner. They were going extremely mad hearing this little boo ghost go boop, 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 so they called me and I said, the problem is this cute thing. The owner was like, this is too cute. It can't be possessing curse, and I said, until they get you. So I grabbed Booba and I threw him in the air and I caught him and I said, Listen here, little ghost, you're gonna be nicer, and you're gonna be cute, and you're gonna be all those things, except you're gonna stop doing the boo. And he looked at me and said, Boo? And he hasn't really booed since. So, we're best friends now. Boo! Next on our cursed object list, we have the spider. Now, the spider isn't cursed, but it looks, it looks like it would be cursed. It's got googly eyes. That's always cursed. If someone has googly eyes, they definitely have a soul behind them. Right, Mr. Spider? See, he doesn't do anything. He's not cursed. He looks like he'd be cursed. But sadly, he's pretty normal. Right, Mr. Spider? What's happening? <laughs> what are you doing, Mr. Spider? Oh, Finally, in our trio of terror, we have the skeleton dragon that I got. The skeleton dragon appears very friendly, but its teeth and mouth actually move. So what would happen is, the homeowner would be sitting watching The Simpsons, presumably, and this little dragon would swoop down and land on their face and bite their little cheek. Oh, it bit my blanket. Let me try it again. It would fly down while they're watching TV and bite them on the nose like this. Now, plastic. This dragon thinks it's made of bone, so it would actually hurt, but it's just made of plastic, so it's a little pinch. It's only a minor inconvenience and a little annoying, but the whole one I was getting real sick of it. He said, I'm trying to watch all my shows, like Charmed, Buffy, Simpsons, and this guy can fly down and bite my fingers. I tried to get popcorn. I said, I can take Mr. Dragon away because he's really cool. And now I have this pet dragon that almost never attacks me because my blankie blocks his bites. So another reason to get a blankie, to avoid the, the dragon skeletons that live in your house. And those are the cursed or haunted objects of October. I hope you enjoyed Ghost Settings, and if you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and follow. Be sure to leave down in the comments below which Halloween cursed object was your favorite. I hope you had a safe and wonderful October, and I look forward to seeing you back here for some more ghost content in my November cursed object series. See you then, ghost And remember, if you find a cursed object, call me so I can add it to my collection.